All right, so I have it on very good authority that um, Japan has great skincare products. And I'm on my way to Mega Don Quixote, which they call Mega Donkey here, and I'm gonna go see what they have, and I will show you guys a video haul of what I bought and how much and what it's for. goodness there's so many choices of things to get in here but I came in with sort of an idea of what I wanted and I think I did pretty good so we're gonna go check out head back to the apartment and then I'll show you what I got All right guys, I'm back from the store and I got my pile of stuff sitting over here next to me. And I'm gonna show you guys what I've got. Okay, let's start out with this first one. This one's really cool. I haven't opened any of the stuff yet, um, but I'll give it all a try and give you guys maybe a review another time, we'll see. But uh, let's check this one out. So this one is rice mask and it's a packet. 
of exactly what you think rice mass and it's all rice that's grown here in japan these are made 100 percent here in japan it's a nice soft feeling there are 10 in this package it was 1375 yen which is about nine dollars and fifty cents and you get 10 masks in here um, and these are really good for just moisturizing your face and just getting that nice soft feeling so i'm looking forward to using these i do love masks that's probably one of my favorite things um, as far as skincare is concerned is masks like these i usually try to get some wherever i go and a lot of times i'll find that they're made in korea which they also have some great skin products as well but the only downfall for me personally from the products is Korea in from Korea is that a lot of them have uh, whitening products which obviously would be kind of odd for me <laughs> for obvious reasons but this rice mask looking forward to using that all right next one this one is cool I've never used a product like this before this is from Suisai and this is a powder wash so it comes in these little um, these little packets. I'm going to see if I can get into it. Yeah, I can. Um, it comes in these little tiny, tiny packets here and they're powder and you take the powder and pour it, the powder out of this package and into your hand. Look at how tiny that is. You pour this powder into your hand and you mix it, kind of lather it up a little bit with some water and then put it all over your face and kind of wash it in. And once you have it all washed in, then you go ahead and clean everything off and it's supposed to be really amazing for washing out impurities and just like uh you know just being out in the environment and just having all those you know impurities from air quality and stuff getting onto your skin this is perfect for that um like i said i've never tried a powder wash so that's going to be really cool to try that out and this product was uh 21 175 yen which is about fifteen dollars and three cents so these are a little bit uh on the higher end but these are red are an absolutely amazing product so for a super clean face i'm looking forward to using those all right next one is this sabarino and this is a morning face mask i've never used face masks in the morning i never think to do that i usually do it at night but this one is supposed to moisturize your face in the morning and help your makeup to kind of stay put i don't wear a ton of makeup since i travel full time um it's kind of a whole hassle to you know schlep around with makeup all the time plus i can't always find the colors that i need um in all places so i don't bother with it too much i just have some light things that i carry with me i'll show you in a second one of the uh makeup products that I bought but this is those morning face wash and this is Sabarini Sabarini's and it's uh yeah it's just like a face wash but you use this for in the morning this is a five pack they do have these in a bigger pack which obviously is going to be more expensive um, but these were $4.99 which is $3.45 that's not bad for five masks that's a pretty good deal that's even cheaper than those rice masks next one up is choosy lip mask and in here it looks like there's only one i tried using my google lens uh, all over it and it looks like there's just one inside of this package and it was 250 yen and that's a dollar 73 which is still not bad for one lip mask i just wanted to try it out um because i usually have some that i carry with me anyways because i do like to keep my lips nice and moisturized all right the next one now this is one of the few makeup items that I use and that is mascara and I was kind of running out which turned out really good for me because I knew I'd be getting some skincare products here and this makeup item is the Kiss Me Heroin Mascara and this item is so popular that they actually have the little uh, lock thingies on it and you have to get somebody to get it for you um, because I think it's quite popular and this one is 1320 yen so it's nine dollars and 12 cents that's actually a super deal for a good quality mascara i pay almost double that in the u.s for the one that i use it's always good if you're going to use mascara as one of your few uh, makeup items it's good to get something that's a good quality so that's that one the next one is dhc lip cream i told you i like to take care of my lips this one is good you use this 
every day. This is a clear one. Um, it doesn't have any tint, but they do also sell these with tint. This one was 514 yen, which is $3.85. That's not bad at all to keep your lips moisturized and protected. I've got even a little bit of sunscreen on there as well. All right, this next one, this one must be super popular as well because they have this one in one of those little plastic boxes that they have to unlock when you get to the cash register. So I got this and it is a serum and it is called Melano CC and it's basically a vitamin C serum for your face um, just to help with anti-aging and all that fun stuff. Um, so this is a good one for that. I'm going to try that out. This one was 1,075 yen, which is $7.43. So that was pretty good, which I guess I don't, I'm not really sure what the thought process is on when they lock stuff down or not, but that was not super expensive for a product like that. All right, next one is this Senka Perfect Whip, and you may have seen this one on maybe TikTok or Instagram or YouTube or something, but this is the Senka um, Perfect Whip. Now see, this was not on lockdown. This They just had buckets of this just sitting all over the place. It was 1,275 yen, which is $8.81, and this is uh, a face wash, and it does not have whitening in it. They do have one that has whitening in it, so um, I made sure to use my <laughs> Google Lens to tell me uh, which one to which one of the two to get because I couldn't tell what the difference was because um, of course all the wording is in Japanese. All right, uh, and then the next one is this Curel. Now I bought this smaller version. There is a much larger bottle. It's probably about twice as big as this one. This one is good to have with you because you can use this moisture spray even when you're out and about. Um, just carry this with you in your bag. It's an intensive Curel intensive um, moisture spray. And this one is 1,075 yen, $7.43. And you can put this on right over makeup or anything, uh, or just your plain face, or, you know, no makeup, naked face if you want. So that's pretty good. You just put it on, spray it, and move your head around, and you're good to go. So that's that one. And then the last product is I bought these eye masks. They do have a lot of eye products. This was a good one. Um, these eye masks, and I couldn't translate the name of it because it gave me a couple different weird versions and I didn't want to tell you like a weird name for it but it's this product here and these are eye masks you put under your eyes and also you can use them around your mouth here as well like for frown lines and it helps to uh, make those fine lines and wrinkles kind of dissipate so I'm going to try those out and see how those go as well so I'm very excited with all of the products that I got today. Um, oh, I forgot to mention, this one was 980 yen, which is $6.77. So yeah, lots of great products here in Japan. Um, I'm gonna try all of these out. Hopefully it doesn't weigh down my suitcase too much. I'll use, we still have about the six weeks left here, so I'll be using quite a bit of this before we leave um, to reduce the uh, weight added to my bag. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that coming along with me to get some skin skincare products. If you have any questions about any of them or uh, once I use these, you want to ask how things are going, go ahead and ask those down below in the comment section. Give me a like on this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more content coming to you from Asia right now from Japan because that's where I'm hanging out. Thanks guys for watching.